Greetings and welcome back to Factorio. I'm Catherine of Sky and we are playing 0 0.15 and I'm very, very um, excited about it. It is looking gorgeous. The HD graphics are deliciously delightful. And um, yeah, we're doing a lot of cool stuff. One of the things that I, I, uh, I read about and I forgot about is that you don't have to do click, click, click. You can just go all the way down, just like, you know, move your mouse up and down. You don't have to even click for it, which is extremely handy, I have to say. So what is the plan for this episode? This episode, we are planning on starting the bus and basically producing a um, just basic, basic production uh, for things that we're going to need, like gears and um, uh, whatchamacallum things, belts and science, a little bit of science. Because right now we're just way ahead on science and we haven't done much else because of, you know, the, um, yeah, the, the costs of everything and, and stuff like that. So I want to get things going. I've started crafting a few things in my inventory, but we're going to need to just get a lot of the uh, product out there into the world so we can start using it just in a regular way. I've been crafting belts, been crafting some inserters just so that we can get all this underway. Looks like we're definitely gonna need some more iron, I mean, copper copper miners so that we can keep up. We had seven science packs. I picked up the old assemblies and stuff like that. So we literally have nothing making any of this other stuff, uh, which is not great. Uh, ooh, I need to make a radar too, I think. Huh. I thought about it and then I forgot about it. Okay, so we are making billions and billions of things in the pocket, which is not a happy occasion for me. I kind of wish I had put down the radar last episode because I don't know what's ahead. I don't, oh my god, there are trees here. No. But um, yeah, it's going to be hopefully a good start for us right now to get the bus started. So I am going to, the plan for this game is I'm going to go for a sort of an, an evolution, rather like the Belt Diva Factory, where we start off with a main bus. Uh, but I have realized that the main bus isn't the end all to factories. It's very useful in many ways. Uh, but we're going to, uh, at, at end game, we're going to make outposts for things and use the train network as uh, transporters instead of a bus. So that's the the general plan for this series, and I'm really interested to see how that system performs under these um, research requirements, you know, the infinite research where we're going to need a lot of materials and a lot of technology, a lot of science to get past it. Um, yeah, that's going to be one of the important things I feel like we're going to we're going to tackle. So let's see. Come on. We need stuff. I just want to clear a little bit of this stuff out of the way. Now, our map shows there's a uranium. Why is the uranium right there? <laughs> it's 1.2 million ore. Uh, this one is a little bit less. So I feel like we should do bus things off to the right, maybe, because there's that ore patch there. Hmm. All right, well, in any case, we'll have, we're gonna start out with, let's say four lanes of copper, and then we'll have our four lanes of iron. And we'll put this this way. Oopsie. Oops. Okay, there we go. Uh, or should we do it to the... Oh, we should do it the other way, actually. We should do it definitely the other way. Uh, right. Let's change this just a bit. How close is this? That's not even that close. That's just fine. All right, we're going to start here. Let's have one, two, three, four, four iron, three, four copper, four of green circuits, four of other stuff, maybe four of other more stuff, uh, like red circuits. We're going to have a belt with stone and stone bricks. We're going to have steel, um, but I think that's going to be good. Let's just make sure we can get this down here. Actually, this is going to be this one. Don't need all that. Um, this one is going to be that one. Oh, no, it's not. It's going to be the end one. 
pardon me. Nope, whoops. Oh, come on, brain. There we go. Nice. Okay, good. Oh, this is so good. I'm really excited about this. And then we're going to need our balancers, but we don't have balancers yet. Um, or we don't have a lot of materials for splitters, which we need to fix that. Let's make some splitters in the inventory. Let's make some of these in the inventory. And, oh, this is so lovely. What's down here? I think what we'll do... Gosh, we have... Let's explore just a little bit. What is down here? Oh, and I made the uh, the radar, didn't I? Oh, there's nothing down here. That's good. I think what I want to do is we're going to put the mall like right here. That's going to be where our mall is because it's quite long and it needs to go in uh, over there, I think. We can do kind of a temporary green circuits in right here, maybe. There should be enough room. Um, we could do like a bootstrap facility, though, for simple things like green circuits initially. You know what? I'm going to make this... Uh, whoops. I ran out of belts. No! I ran out of belts. I probably don't need this many of this. Let's just have a few of these. Let's have five of those and five of those. That should be tidying us over for a bit. We'll put this one here. That one will go there, and we'll change them around as we, we get them organized. We've got plenty of uh, materials at the moment. Yeah, this is, yeah, we could have green circuits like right there. I'm thinking, yeah. I really need to import the blueprint for them all. That is going to be pretty important. Oh, actually, I have all that I need right here, don't I? Okay. Righty. Now, uh, should I do a small green circuit assembly here? I could. I could, because we're not going to use this uranium for quite some time. Um, and by the time we have really large assemblies of green circuits, they're going to be elsewhere. So I feel like it's okay to put it over here. I want to have, let's see, we want to mark out a space for the fluid bus. And I think what I'll do is I'll, oops, oopsie, come on, oh, no, no, there we are. I'm just not even thinking correctly. I'm just so excited, I can't even think straight. All right, let's see, one, two, three, four. Let's have this for the fluid bus, and then we're going to have, ooh, I don't have any stone bricks yet. Um, then I want a path of four. Let's have a path of one, two, three, four. And then we can have our machines up here. I have taken the liberty of making a few of these machines, which is nice. Put them like three away, maybe. Uh, let's go here. Now, I haven't checked to see, are the recipes the same? We're going to have to figure this out. We're going to have, okay, two copper cables every half a second. Okay, and then what about green circuits? Green circuits is 10 copper cables every half a second. Seems like a lot. All right, so copper cables is going to be, <laughs> we're going to need five machines because we need two every we need 10 copper cable every half a second so these pro provide two every half a second so we need five of them that's an awful lot of machines that's pretty darn scary we may have to figure out much better ways of um <laughs> of doing this stuff this is this is going to be really challenging i feel all right let's get our um Incoming iron, and then we're going to have outgoing green circuits there. And let's get our... Uh, wait, we need better inserters, don't we? Oh, this is very expensive, though. Yeah, we do need the better... We just need the better inserters. There's no reason to not have them. All right, so how do we want to distribute this? This is going to be 
Not a happy time, I feel. We could do something like this kind of thing. Like, and this will be for the next one that comes down. Okay. Oh, I missed my insert. Oh, that's right. I wasn't going to do those inserters because I was waiting for the blue ones. Yep. Okay. Come on, blue inserters. I need you. Okay, so this is going to be probably... Okay, and we'll take this one off. get this going on here. Uh, oh, wait, 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 wait. This won't, <laughs> that doesn't work. Oh no, these don't work this way at all. Um, that's not good. Okay, so after starting and restarting a couple of times on this design, I've kind of come up with something that is going to work-ish. So we're going to see how it, how it goes. Um, Let's see, because we need five machines feeding this thing. This is like really interesting. Actually, it's kind of a relief because um, we got so used to the old designs that we never were thinking about anything else. So I'm really excited. I feel like I can design things again. I feel like I'm just able to have, you know, a, a more creative time doing this. I'm really excited about this. This is good. Okay, so this is, there we go. Um, we are, let's get our splitter here. And the next thing probably is gonna be here, kind of like here. So that's the idea that I've got with this. Now, the question is how do I get stuff? Okay, I can get the, Iron in here. Oops, I need this. Iron there, and of course, green circuits output. Oops, I don't have one. I need another one. There we go. Green circuits output there. Okay, nice. Let's get our power poles strung down this way. Okay. Oh, really? There we go. here. Now let's try to be efficient with these things we need to have there. Um, yeah, we're yeah, It's going to be a mess no matter what way I try to do this, I sense. All right, so let's just put them a little bit evenly. Maybe that will be better. Of course, once we have um, the steel poles, they have a, a larger uh, range. So, okay, so what's, why are we still stopped on electricity? Probably because these are not hooked up. Probably. That would be reasonable to assume that. All right, how are we doing? Aha, we have green light. Excellent. Okay. So, oh my god, we're making green circuits. Whoa, almost. Almost. Let's get our uh, iron to go here. Great. Oh, this is actually quite exciting that this is so different. I'm like, whoa, <laughs> this is good. All right, let's get this tree thing out of the way. I want to get this moved uh, and put this that way. Great. So I'm going to get a balancer here. That goes here, but I also want to put some in a box. We have a box here. Let's see. We'll get our, um, yeah, there we go. I'm gonna have this have one stack for now. Wow, this is running like a boss. This is awesome. Look at this. This is perfect. Looking really good. 
We have a little bit of buildup in the chests because, of course, we didn't connect the iron right away, but it's looking awesome. All right, so let's get this across. I'm going to need to have these going to its destination. Right, then that's going to be here. Nice. Very, very cool. I'm quite happy with this. This is this is so funky. I <laughs> just like I am amazed and interested and kind of weirded out a little bit. It's it's very 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 funky. I like it. All right, let's get this guy sorted out. We don't need we just need that, I think. Right? Right. Okay, we can get rid of this. Uh, and let's just leave it at, we're not going to name it or anything. I think we're just going to leave that. We need to get rid of this tree. So we definitely want more than one green circuit maker. Man, if the rest of the game is like this, this is going to be very funky and quite, um, I don't know, interesting, possibly frustrating, possibly who knows what. But if we need a lot of, uh, of stuff. This is, I, I don't know. I'm just like excited about this. I kind of like it. It's just giving us the chance to be creative again. Okay. You can also drag these guys like that. No need to multi multi click all over the place, which is very nice. All right. Let's get our chests in here and we'll copy this paste paint did it. Yeah. It, did. it pasted exactly what I wanted to. Oh, and I've run out of belts. So we're going to have to, I think what, what I need to do is grab the blueprint for the mall, um, which I need to do. It's, um, I will grab it in between, probably in between episodes, I think, because we don't really need it at this very moment, but we are going to need stuff eventually. This goes there. Man, the only thing that would make this perfect is we just need those darned, um, whatchamacallum things. Early game robots. That's what we need. Okay, get all the iron. Do we need copper? Mm, a little bit. Get a little bit of copper. Get a little bit of green circuits. Yeah. Oh yeah. So now we can make proper inserters again. Alright. And I'm gonna need another splitter, which is good. Get this going down here. But yeah, this is so good. I'm just thrilled. This is just so fun. This is like nice. Okay, you're going to go there. And let's get in the power poles since we've got that to do yet. Goes there. This one goes here and here. And we're going to need our splitter. Come on, game. Show me the splitter. Oh, yes. You know what else we can do? put down? We can put down our radar. Where is our radar? Here, let's get this one. Plonk. And I was going to put one also by... Whoa, that's a big area. Do they always cover that much area? Seems like more. Anyway, I'm going to go put another one up by power. Just so we can see where biters are coming from. <laughs> oh, are there new achievements? Let's look. Oh no, I have 100%. So no more. There are no more new achievements, which is kind of sad. I kind of wanted one maybe for like using nuclear power or something like that. That would have been nice. All right, let's just go up here and place our radar down. Oh my gosh, this is, I, I have this very thrill of excitement within me. Like, oh my God, what else have we not discovered? You know, and we're going to figure it out and we're going to see and it's going to be fun and lovely. And it's going to be awesome. So how are we doing on power? We're doing, okay, we're good. We're like halfway on power. Wait, did I not put these down? Of course not. Okay. Why did I not put them? I don't know. Let's just put them because we have them and there's no reason for them to be clogging our inventory. Same thing with the pipes. And we can also put down these burner inserters. Mostly so we don't forget we have them. Oops, there we are. And I will get the power poles in here as well. Now that's something that I'd like to see improve is like when you have like there, uh, not 
like when you move the power pole over the shadow, it still shows in a weird direction sometimes. I wish it would only show one direction, like on the on the thing. I mean, I know they change directions because of you know how they're connected to the wires, but it's kind of confusing. Um, so if any of the devs are listening, hi. Um, that would be a nice thing because it's it looks weird sometimes. It's hard to describe, but yeah. Anyway. So, all right, we've got that sorted out. We've got our radars. What can we see on the map? Oh, wow, look at the scanning. Let's go. Oh, here's the, um, now this is very cool. Now I'm told, I, or I, I read at least, I think we can do this. I think we can put blueprints. This is the map view, guys. We can actually put blueprints on the map view. And this is fantastic. Oh my God, look at the blueprint. They're even like moving. This is just awesome. So we can um, we can do solar from space. This is so good. I love this, love this. So I love the new map. I love everything, yay. <laughs> I really do. Anyway, I think we've run out of time for this episode. I'm gonna go and grab a mall blueprint and uh, get it out here. I might even try uh, Mike's five wide new mall, um, which is another very cool variation. Um, and I will see you back in the next episode. So thank you so much for joining me. Take care of yourselves and each other, and I'll see you next time.